Hello, everyone! What have I been doing, you ask? Well, I'll tell you. In fact, I'll show you what I've been doing. Okay, let's go to... Angry Aztec. 5 out of 5. 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 5, out of five. five, out of five. I got all the golden bananas from Angry Aztec, and I didn't make a video of it, and I'll tell you why. Because getting Tiny's last fucking banana, racing that fucking beetle, took me so many tries, the video would have been an hour long. I kid you not. So I was going to make a video, but then I decided not to because of that crap. So now, instead, I'm going to move these rocks with Chunking Kong. Let's see what this little triangle thing does, because I forgot. Let's see, let's see. Oh! Oh! Ho ho! Another golden mana for Noah! Donkey Kong! Huh. Okay, um, let's see here. And that one is Linky's. And I think if I go inside of this building here, then when I come back out, the rock will be there again. So I'm going to try to use the banana porter pad instead and see what that does. Get Lang King. Don King Kong. He's the king of the Kongs. As a wise man once said to me. Okay, let's see. Uh, another banana, maybe? Perhaps? Perchance? Per se? One of Cranky's special barrels. Oh, sweet! I actually needed that. It's too bad that's all the way over like at the entrance of Fungi Forest, which I can't even get to until I think I beat the boss from Gloomy Galleon. I can't even get there. And Gloomy Galleon, here we go. The entrance is right down here, underwater. And this is easily my least favorite world in this game, and I'll tell you why. Because I hate water worlds, like worlds that take place underwater, or like a majority part underwater. And this one definitely, definitely does that. If I'm not mistaken, I think Chunky's Splat is in here. And it is. Where's that tag barrel dough? There it is. It's above the water for some reason. And this place is like... Like, this whole game is pretty moody. But this place is like easily the moodiest place out of all of them. Out of all the worlds, this place is just like the gloomiest, most moody place. I guess besides Creepy Castle, I fell in the water. Ow. You got me with a one-two punch. Take that. Alrighty. Easy business. Alright, let's... Get up there, dude. <laughs> 30 bananas. Oh, that's funny. That's cute. 30 bananas, he says. Okay. I underestimated those Kongs. Their progress is unexpected. Chief Technician! I trust the Blastomatic will soon be ready to be activated. We, we've just had a few technical problems, Your Majesty, and my men are all lazy. He's lying, sire. He's always asleep. <laughs> I don't know why I'm making these voices. But please forgive me, O oh Great One. God! Make sure no one leaves until my machine is ready. Gotta make a run for it. Oh no! <laughs> That's terrible. Talk about bad working conditions. And I bet they get paid minimum wage too. And here we are, Gloomy Galleon. It's a very gloomy place as you can see. Oh look at that. Looks like I'm already headed in the right direction. A one switch? A two switch? Um, okay, what's in here?
I can't even get up there until it's high tide. So I guess we'll forget about this place for now. For now. But trust me, I'll be back. So I'll go ahead and get out. I don't even know where to start, man. There's so much stuff to do. I guess we'll get out Lanky and uh, just go ahead and start some banana collecting. Because I will need those bananas in order to get to the boss. Well, one thing's for sure, guys. The lighthouse is that away. Oh, I hate those freaking Viking things. <laughs> it's funny. What's up here, you ask? Well, I'll tell you. I don't exactly know. Let's try that again. Pad number three is up here. Along with the Trophoscoff barrel and a splat. Ho ho! You can bet I'm going to come back with Tiny. Right now. Alright, let's go, Tiny. Got some stuff to do. Alright. Can't you make the jump? Can't you make the jump again? Can't you make the jump a third time? Indeed. Indeed she can. Whoa! We're off to a good start, it looks like. So what's down here, though, you ask? Some enemies. And some stuff for... I guess Chunky Kong is to punch those open. So let's go back and get him. It's nothing but like an endless, like, going back and getting different Kongs to do different stuff. That's why a lot of people hated this game. Like, not just disliked it, but like, literally hated it. Like, they thought it was the worst game ever made. It's like, at some point you just gotta like, realize the fact that, dude, it's a game made by Rare. It can't be all that bad. But people disagree with me, they think it's that bad. Like, I've seen on YouTube, like, comments on, like, gameplay of Donkey Kong 64. People are, people are like, dude, why would you play this game? It's literally the worst game ever made. Like, and they're, like, 100% serious about it. I was like, what are you talking about? It's not the worst game ever made. The worst game ever made would be... I don't know, there's a lot of bad ones out there. Superman 64? I don't know. Oh, look, a fairy. I can actually take pictures of those now. Is that the camera? Oh, whatever, I did not miss. Give me a break. Come here, you little fairy. You think I'm some, some kind of fucking fairy? You think I'm a little fairy boy? No way! No way! Okay, third time's a charm. Gotcha. Yay! And she's gonna restore all my stuff. Thanks. Whoa. Now we're rashes on the ground. Little Miley, Miley Cyrus humor for you there. Let's go this way first. To the lighthouse. And I need, I need Donkey Kong to open the gate. Open the gate! Hey. 
Wrong button. Whoa. Alright. <sighs> Where do I even begin? I seriously just don't know what to do right now. There's so many things to do. It's like... I don't know, you've been like studying, like you're doing homework or something like that, and you have like so much to do, to do you're just like... You just don't want to do any of it. That's kind of how I feel right now. Well, we've got three different things for three different people up here. So I guess the first order of business would be finding a tag barrel. Or maybe changing the tide to high tide. There we go. There you go, my friend. One well, brand new Steven Jackson jersey. Pad 5 activated. Oh. There we go. I like the red sky. Nice touch. Whoa, that was close. This gets a little confusing. <laughs> Back to the start again, it looks like. Well, this one's just kind of confusing. Okay, now what? <laughs> okay, there's only one place to go then, I guess. Okay, man, I'm thoroughly confused now. the heck? Which way do I go? I mean, there's only one way to go. Okay, there's a one first barrel. Ah, there we go. Didn't see the last one. All right, done. Okay. A lot of interesting things happen from that. And let's see, what does this do? Oh, now I can go inside the lighthouse. After I shoot this, this uh, balloon, of course. I'm just gonna come full circle back around. Ah, oh, you kidding me? Get it. There you go. Okay. In the gauntlet we go. Creepy. Hello. There's a ladder here? Yeah, okay. Hmm. 
This little tower here reminds me of something. I'm sure you guys, if you're any fan of Nintendo games, know what it is. It is the tower from Super Mario 64, from Thwomp's Fortress or whatever. Ow. Fell. Looks just like it, actually. Like, almost identical. Same style of, like, platforms that go, like, in and out. Nice one, Rare. Decided to copy off Nintendo, did you? Well, honestly, I can't blame you, because... With the success that they had from that game, I, I wouldn't blame you. Great game. Oh, no! Oh, of course. Fell all the way back to the bottom? Oh, look, a balloon. I hate when you're like at the, just exactly the wrong spot to like shoot at balloons. It's really annoying. Ay ay ay. Let's try it again. I think, like, if I'm not mistaken, there's not even a golden banana up here. It's like some kind of, kind of switch or something like that. I'm pretty sure. We'll see. Okay. So far, so good. Yeah, that's what I thought. Switch. Not even one freaking banana to be like. Wow. Okay then, well, whatever. Looks like some Sith lightning inside there. It turns on the lighthouse, which does nothing, it looks like. Okay, okay. Brings the ship into harbor. Alright then. A chain reaction, so to speak, of events that all end with me not getting a banana. Oh, I got a banana. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what I was bitching about then. Because I ended up getting one anyways. It'll fall all the way back down here. Oh. Somehow only lost one watermelon slice from that. From that, like, 100 foot fall. If not more. Alright, well, making pretty good progress, I guess, so far. Let's go see what's on the ship. I don't even know how to get on it. I guess I have to have Diddy for that. He was just like his uh, jet barrel. Let's see what's underwater. Man, this place is gloomy. Hence the name, I suppose. What is there to do over here? Absolutely nothing. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I've got to get at least one more banana before I, like, end this episode. Okay, so here's what we'll do. Oh, found the thing. Oh, I know what to do. Where'd it go? There it is. We'll get Lanky out, and we'll turn into On Guard, the swordfish, so I can break these chests open. Swim carefully to grab these bananas. 
Yum yums. But that now I have 58 of. <laughs> so it's just an excessive amount of collecting in there, I guess, in this game. Look at that. It's so return to being Linky. Press and hold Z and the press left. Okay. There's gotta be a banana in at least one of these. You know what I'm saying? There has to be. I think there's a couple other things for me to break open besides just these chests, like a... Uh... Ah, there it is. I can't get it right now, of course. Let me go see what else needs to be busted open. Before I... Uh, quit doing this. I know there's like some sort of like gate somewhere, like on the wall or something like that. There has to be. If I know platformers, then... Ah, there it is. What's in here, like nothing? Okay, well, that's great. Big freaking waste of time. Anything else of importance? Well, there's one chest. Alright then. Grab this banana and end the episode.